alone, abandoned, angry. At 18, he had no family and was beginning to lose hope after being arrested during this major uprising until he found an unlikely father figure and a persistent cellmate who completely transformed his life. The 1981 Brixton uprising was a war between black British youth and oppressive white police. But inside this historic rebellion is also the story of 18 year old Alex Weedle and a Rastafarian man named Simeon who forged an unforgettable friendship. That June, Weedle watched the families of other arrested youth come to support them in court. Having grown up in foster care, he would never had that. And he figured he never would. In his loneliness, he wondered about ending his life. But later, in their tiny cell, Simeon demanded that Weedle tell him his life story. From CLR James and James Baldwin to African civilizations and civil rights movements across the diaspora, Simeon shared rich Black stories with him too. He showed Weedle how the system creates struggle and how love is our counterattack. If you've ever felt like Weedle and someone nurtured you to keep going, you know love is more than a feeling. And Weedle grew to continue its liberating cycle. He reconnected with his Jamaican parents. He became a father with his own family. And today, Weedle is a storyteller, publishing award-winning novels for youth harboring the same rage and loneliness he once did. The stories are already there, he says, sometimes going unnoticed, ignored, or rejected. All I do is try to make them important. We all know schools aren't teaching Black history correctly. That's why Push Black is so important. Will you support truthful, accurate, empowering Black history content with a donation? Click the link in our bio to donate now.